your reigning source, your undisputed place for WWE. Remember to subscribe, click the bell, share this video, and make sure to become a channel member today to help secure and save my future on YouTube because I've said it once, I'll say it a million times, I can't do this alone. Let's get right in to the thick of the news. Ladies and gentlemen, the WWE, huge changes, massive updates coming in world wrestling entertainment. And guys, it's so crucial to like and comment on this video today and share this video all over social media. WWE Elimination Chamber 2025 no longer happening in the UK. And there seems to be a lot of outrage. There seems to be a lot of doubt. There seems to be a lot of criticism between the WWE and the United Kingdom right now over this uh, controversial decision to kick off the brash in the brazier where we raise the bar to all-time levels and heights in the WWE. Also, Daniel Garcia calls out retired wrestlers for making their careers by criticizing AEW. Well, AEW can, you know, blame themselves for their own criticisms and their own, you know, downfalls and their own um, problems because AEW ultimately is in charge of their own issues, their own problems that they need to work out, and they need to work out the kinks. AEW obviously needs to go back to the drawing board as to what worked. Also, ladies and gentlemen, Bobby Lashley reveals that he was offered a fight with Iron Mike Tyson. Now, can you imagine what would have happened in that? That would have been absolutely hellacious. The identity of MGF's the girl that was given the little masseuse during the 10:23 AEW Dynamite has absolutely been revealed online. Yes, indeed, she is being revealed. Also, ex WWE star Mandy Rose shows off in behind the scenes red bikini top photo drop. You can find that online. And again, not only do we sh not only do we talk about it, but we also show it here on Sean's View Entertainment. Also. WWE had an intriguing internal title for the 10-22 WWE NXT show. For those of you that pay attention and watch WWE NXT. Apparently, ladies and gentlemen, the October, <coughs> the October 22nd edition of NXT saw WWE develop a romance storyline between Oba Femme and Nikita Lyons. Uh, Zariah made her day shocking debut to close the show and many other such moments took place throughout the night. According to a report by Fightful Select, this week's episode of NXT was internally referred to as Who Was Afraid of a Little Old Spin? The name is certainly an intriguing one as it does show a lot of changes throughout the night. We'll have to wait and see whether NXT will keep the momentum going with their upcoming episode, Halloween Havoc, which will be on WWE NXT. But remember, there is rumors and speculation that WWE Halloween Havoc will no longer be an NXT tradition, but it will be moving to the main roster, hopefully, in the next coming years. Your thoughts, your comments, and your opinions. Also, WWE's decision to run NXT at the 2300 Arena surprised talent everywhere. I mean, the, in, in the, East, the old ECW Arena, the influence, the intrigue, the history, the dynamic of that arena, formerly known as the ECW Arena, several sources within NXT that spoke to were surprised by the announcement that the brand would be running the 2300 Arena. Some had heard of it as being a possibility, but dismissed it as being too out there. Now, accordingly, do you think WWE made a smart decision by running NXT at the historic ECW Arena? Ladies and gentlemen, also receiving word that TNA Bound for Glory press conference recap highlights and reactions for October the 24th can be absolutely found online. Also, Leo Rush admits that initial AEW run was disastrous from the beginning. <clears throat> also here on the brash and the brazen. A $250 million plagiarism lawsuit against AEW and WWE has absolutely been dismissed. Your thoughts, your comments, and your opinions on that. And I just knew when I first, first, that, when I first heard that story that that was going to go absolutely nowhere. What a waste of time. What a waste of money. And, and what a waste to even try to do something quite like that. Obviously, there was no... They, 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 they were just, I mean, really trying to say that it was stolen. It was, it, you know, stole my ideas, stole this, stole that. Well, so much for that $250 million. And did you think it was just going to be that easy? Did you think AEW and WWE, respectively, were just going to hand you over $250 million? Liv Morgan goes off on Rhea Ripley fans. 
you're probably ugly and have no lives. Also, Rhea Ripley, excuse me, Liv Morgan and Dominic Mysterio have their own official WrestleMania 41 truck. Your thoughts, your comments, that picture has leaked online. Also, ladies and gentlemen, Goldberg addresses his confrontation with Gunther at WWE Bad Blood 2024. Goldberg saying pretty much, listen, I'm still breathing air, and as long as you're going to be talking about me or my family, I'm going to go in there and give you everything I have, but let's not look too much into this Gunther thing. However, there is rumors and speculation that Goldberg and Gunther will have some sort of confrontation either at the Crown Jewel event or at the Survivor Series. Also, Breaking news as it concerns WWE star dealing with blindness. Ladies and gentlemen, according to those in the know, the dirt sheets, the websites, and the newsletters, Natalia reveals struggles of wrestling with legal blindness for several years. Yes, you heard that right. Several years of blindness for Natalia. The boat, as they call her, the best of all time. Your thoughts, your comments, and your reactions. Also, breaking news on WWE TKO. TKO secures acquisition of professional bull riders, IMG, and on location in a massive $3.25 billion deal. So now TKO is in charge of WWE. They're in charge of UFC and now bull riding, ladies and gentlemen. Trick Williams is being criticized for not displaying vulnerability during the 10-22 NXT segment. So maybe some backstage heat there for one Trick Williams. Your thoughts, your comments, and your opinions. Ryback accuses Carmella Harris of being involved with narcotics. How true is this? How factual is this? Also, ladies and gentlemen, AEW star still has heat with NJPW after going off script during a match. Unflaring photo shows concerning turnout for the 1023 Dynamite last night. And again, guys, we don't just talk about it. We prove it and we show it through images, through detail. There it is, guys, a very unflattering photo of AEW. Also here on the Brash and the Brazen, the reason behind the surge in ticket prices for WrestleMania 41 is absolutely being revealed online. Yeah, if you noticed, if you noticed, viewers, the ticket price is astronomical, out of this world, more money than I have ever seen a WrestleMania ticket. I mean, the WrestleMania tickets were already high. They were already outrageous. But by God, you might as well take out a loan uh, like you're buying a house, like you're buying a mini car, because that is just how ridiculous the WrestleMania 41 ticket prices are. And if you can afford that, hey, more power to you. Get out the credit cards. Get out the charge cards, because you might need it. And you might have to go in with a couple of friends or family members in order to get the job done if you want to be at WrestleMania. Ladies and gentlemen, speaking about WrestleMania, breaking news I am working on as it concerns just who John Cena will face at WrestleMania 41. Remember to subscribe, click the bell, turn on all notifications for future episodes and future videos from Sean View Team. Because as you know, if it weren't for you, there would be no Sean View. We come through when the lights are absolutely on bright and they have never shined brighter. And you know what? It's October and it's supposed to be cooler. It's supposed to be, you know, the jackets, the coats, the sweaters. But instead, we're in the short sleeves. We're still sweating. We're still hot. We're still scorching in October so obviously it's going to be flaming and it's going to be a hot tamale because ladies and gentlemen Sean Viewtainment started fire and we're going to end fire subscribe stay tuned plenty more to come from the ba 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 rash one later cut it I said cut cut subscribe